Hello to my YouTube friends, and today we have a ticket from 1990. Yup, you got the right. 1990, wow folks, 30 years ago. Guess what, this ticket is unscratched. So you can see it's a legit ticket. Never been scratched, of course it has no cash value. Also back then, the floor already never put um, the top price on the ticket. So I have no idea how much it was, but this is an un unscratched 1990 floor already ticket, as you can see, legit. Look at the serial number in the back, it was ticket number 253, as you can see. Um, it says all tickets and transaction winners are subject to lottery rules and state law. Ticket invalid if not con conformance with lottery rules. Liability of for invalid ticket is limited to replacement of ticket, refund, or retail sell price, sales price. Ticket purchasers must be at least 18 years old. Okay, there it is. Actually, there's no instructions. I'm, I mean, of how much the top price is, but that's fine. Do not accept the ticket if altered in any way. Okay, so I guess they had this little. Um, box back there for authorization number. Of course, they still have the name, address, phone, city, state, zip, and signature. And it was um, serial number 20040073 and ticket number 253. Even though it doesn't say a top price, it's a 1990 ticket. And no, like I said, it has no value, but I wanna, we're going to scratch it live to see how the ticket worked back then. Let me get a point, folks. And you know what? Hopefully, um, you know what? Even though it has no cash value, of course, that ticket is way long expired. But you know what? It's good because you know what, folks? At the end of the day, the most important part is to go back in time a little bit sometimes and remember old times. So let's get down to scratching. I can't, I can't believe I, I, because I'm not usually home right now. So usually, well, I'm home, but in the no part of the house. So usually I can't find the, um, okay, I'm going to be using, um, Oh, there it is. I gym to your poker ship. There we go. Okay, so let's see. Let me zoom this in a little bit more. I'm sorry I'm wearing gloves. I was just doing stuff in the house. I wanted to do this video. Board if we move. So let's see, folks. Let's see how 1990 looks. Oh, my God. It doesn't scratch. Let me find something else. Let me get this green one. Oh, there we go. 20 bucks. My God. Scratch out, folks. I've changed so much in Florida. $2. Ticket. Oh my god, remember when they had ticket back then? Look at that folks. Ticket, remember that? Oh my god. Two dollars. Oh look, it's a two dollar winner, folks. There we go. It's a two dollar winner. You know what? Florida Lord. Let me see if they got codes. Yep, they do. Look at that. The famous oh my god, they have the codes. And they also have let me see how they did it back then, folks. They have these numbers in the bottom here. So this is actually a two dollar winner. So you know what, Florida Lordy? This ticket expired from years ago. As you can see, TWO, the code for two. And 222, two, two, so $2 donation to the Florida Education because it was never cashed. There you go. So the Florida already kept $2 more. And God knows how many um, unclaimed tickets they were. So there it is, 222. Two, two. Look at the code TWO back then. And I guess this was like a control number or something back then. Board of Remove. Let's see what it says on Board of Remove because, of course, it's another. There it is. Oh, there we go. So I guess it was born and removed because whatever you win will be set down here. As you see, it's $2. All right. So there you go, folks. 1990 ticket, $2 winner. Donation to the Flow Lottery. Thank you so much for watching, folks. Have yourself an awesome sauce day. Love you guys. Just wanted to share this with you guys. I'm going to get um, a tic tac toe um, ticket from 1991 soon. So we shall see. Thank you so much for watching, folks. Throwback time. Even though it's not Thursday, but hey. I wanted to share this with you guys. Love you guys.